Trevor, in our previous conversation, we talked about creating content. And again, it's a hot topic. And again, it's becoming kind of a must uh, to share your ideas, to know who you are. So in that sense, what tips you can give to job seekers? Again, they are not comfortable or they're not used to creating content or they don't know how to write or they're afraid of sharing their ideas. So what tips you have? Yeah, the first thing that I noticed right off the bat when I'm teaching my audience to create content um, is that they don't know where to start, right? It's kind of like uh, getting writer's block, right? You hear about writer's block. So where you want to start is don't think about reinventing the wheel. Go to where content already lives and breathes. And what's the number one search engine in the world? Google, Google, right? <laughs> when Google you want to know something, when you want to learn something, what do you do? You Google it. Yes. Go to Google. And like, let's say you were in HR. Yes. Type in HR and then type in the, in the back end, type in mistakes. Mm -hmm. And what you're going to find is all of this content that's already been created. So I don't care what industry you're in. If you're in IT, project management, QA, yes. accounting and finance, type the word mistakes at the back end. You'll see a bunch of content come in go watch it, go read it, go learn, right? What you're gonna do is you're gonna sharpen your own skills, okay? Because you're learning every day about your own industry. And then you're gonna go recreate that content, okay? Put it in your own words. After you read the article or watched the video, go put it in your own words. What were your thoughts on the video or the content? Now it becomes your content, okay? It's repurposed and you start to become the thought leader in your industry. You're the go-to HR person. You're the go-to IT person. Yes. So that's what I would do. Go to Google. And what about this constant, uh, in terms of like and shares? Do you think that it's good or people should put ideas also? You know, definitely the comment is worth the most points. Um, the algorithms want to see conversation. They want to see activity. Yes. Um, but the, the likes and the shares are valuable too. So um, yeah, I, I think that if your content is valuable, you're gonna get the engagement. Yeah. If it's not, that's okay, don't worry about it. If you start posting content and you notice it's not going anywhere, that's usually what happens in the beginning. Yeah. But, yeah. What, but what happens is when you practice, you start to get what, better, right? Yeah. You, you start to get better at your craft. You start to become a better writer. You start to make better content, better videos. like. Michael Jordan was not Michael Jordan the first time he threw a basketball, All right. right? So yes. don't expect to be Gary V <laughs> the first <laughs> time you make content. It's not yeah. gonna happen. Yeah, I agree, I agree. It's all about practicing. I believe like when I started three years ago, my, my first video, I, it, it took me one hour to do one minute because I wasn't comfortable, the words were not coming. So I practice, I practice now, it's kind of natural for me to speak in front of the camera. Yeah, you just get better at it. Yeah, again, thank you for those great tips, Trevor. Again, for the audience watching and listening, if you have any other tips in terms of creating content, please leave it a comment below and tune in next time for other great questions with Trevor.